Hey everyone, Rayo here, and welcome back to Reckless Ranger. If you're new to this series, this series is focused on getting best in slot range gear, setting new range PRs, and becoming better with the range style overall, and we do it in a progression sort of manner. So we are getting PRs along the way while we are unlocking very important unlocks, like Gricko, which is going to be the focus of this episode. So if you enjoy this series, make sure to give it a like, make sure to give this video a like, drop a comment down below, and subscribe for more content. I also stream a lot of my progress live, so if you want to come hang out or even join me, make sure to follow me over on Twitch. But without further ado, let's get into the video. So as I mentioned just a few seconds ago, the main focus of this video is going to be unlocking Gricko. We are not stopping until we get enough for Gricko or we get a Gricko drop. And we are sitting on a 402 mil coin pouch right now. And to remind you or just notify you if you are new to this series, I am doing a giveaway once I unlock Rico because I technically already have it. But because this is a progression series, I haven't wanted to use it because I haven't technically unlocked it from a new ranging standpoint. So I've been building the style from the ground up, sort of, for the most part. Um, so I just would want to unlock it again by getting it as a drop or quote unquote buying it. And where that money is going to go is in a giveaway. So make sure to stay tuned for more information on the giveaway or the future giveaway at the end of the video. But before we get into any of the new content, let me catch you up on some of the progress I've made this past week. Oh, heck yeah, dude. Yes, dude. <laughs> oh, yes, bro. You know what this reminds me of? This is totally off topic, but I just got to tell it to Calvin. Bro, um, I got a Pernix cow this morning before work so so take that <laughs> wow nobody asked <laughs> i know but you're here and so i have to inform you of every drop that i get that way you can be a, just a little bit more uh salty why am i toxic i don't know bro i don't know couldn't tell you i've just been hurt in my life and i need to take it out on others i'm gonna enjoy your planking <laughs> can't believe you're expecting me to plank at the unplankable boss bro i've become amazing at nex okay famous last words as i'm yeah as i'm getting freaking annihilated like nex is like okay yeah let me hold you to that bro <laughs> oh my god oh my are you joking <laughs> no way dude no way dude <laughs> dude this game sucks dude no way dude I don't know what you're doing, Calvin, but I'm really carrying the DPS, so I'm going to need you to pick it up a little bit. <laughs> oh, you, you a-hole. <laughs> and you... <laughs> yes, dude. Oh, yes. Everybody remember this. Rip. <laughs> Wait a minute. <laughs> let's, let's remember this. Yet another. Oh, yes. Oh, my gosh, dude. Oh, my gosh. Yes. Yes. Oh, heck yeah, bro. Oh, my gosh. It's done, dude. We got full pernix out of the way. Holy crap, dude. Yes, dude. Oh, yes, dude. That is so sick. Oh, dude. I am so amped. <laughs> I am so amped. All right. We got to... We've got to augment it. We've got to start using it, dude. Okay, now we got to augment it. Disassemble the armadillo chest plate. Oh, yeah, bro. Perks on into the Pernix body, dude. Oh, this is so good. This is so good, dude. I'm amped. Oh, nice. Now we have enough armadillion components, and we're getting close to... We actually have enough armadillion components and Illujankin components to do uh, a aftershock roll. So let's go ahead and see if we can do a two for one, knock it out. All right, come on. P6A1, come on. Oh, yes, dude. <laughs> one more perk and then we're all done, dude. Uh, granted, that one's not the hardest one to get, but I was really worried seeing how last time went. Oh my gosh, dude. That needs to not happen ever again. <laughs> oh my gosh, no way, bro. Yes. Oh, dude. We're just... We're just banking today. Holy crap, dude. Oh my gosh, yes, dude. 
Yes, dude, and it's a log item. Heck yeah, bro. Well, what would a Gricko grind be without doing a little bit of Raksha? We got six Raksha for our Reaper task, and we're getting really close on a Hydrix, so hopefully we can get Gricko this task. I'm not expecting it by any means, but if we do, awesome. If not, then we are coming up on a Hydrix, and I do have some other plans for what I can do to make money, but let's just, uh, let's just see what we get from Raksha first. And Dino Bones, not too bad. Oof. Adrenaline crystals. Probably the worst. <laughs> the only thing worse than stone spirits is adrenaline crystals. Oh, nice. Two out of three have been over a mil. That's what I like to see. Heck yeah, more dinosaur bones, dude. Very, very good. Oh, gosh. <laughs> Seeds are... <laughs> okay, maybe the other worst drop are seeds as opposed to adrenaline crystals. Something I've had sitting in my bank for the longest time is a spider leg top and middle. I've been missing the spider leg bottom, and I also have an Araxes web. So I'm going to test my luck at Raxor because I believe the darkness path is open right now. Yeah, spider minions are blocked off, so we'll have a pretty easy time with ranged, I feel like. The kills will probably be a little bit slow, but it won't be super hectic. So let's just test our luck at Rax, see if we can finish off the spider leg, because that would be another 200 some odd mil that we could put on top of the coin pouch. Now for a first kill, that was um, a lot smoother than I thought it was going to go. I haven't done Rax in a long, long time, but I mean, 450k, 425k, not too shabby. That wasn't too bad of a kill time. 343.8. That's pretty nice. Let's see what we get. Oh my gosh, no freaking way, bro. <laughs> Yo. Oh my gosh, no way. That was so quick. <laughs> bro, I'm so pumped. I am so pumped. Yes, dude. Oh, that's so sick. Oh man, heck yeah. Go ahead and craft the spider leg. A nice 210 mil. How much more is it for a... Oh, oh, it's another 9 mil. I guess we'll go ahead and make the bow then for another 9 mil. <laughs> I just, I can't believe that, dude. I can't believe that. That is so good. Wow, even better. 333.6. Dang, dude. These are pretty decent kill times, I'll be honest. Oh, heck yeah. Hydrix bolt tips. <laughs> Might not seem like a big deal, but these are the first ones I've ever gotten since this series started. So that's pretty huge. I can actually start making my own. Because these are running out real quick. Oh, nice. All right, last kill of the hour. What do we get? Oof. Well, honestly, you know, even without the leg piece, that was a really good hour. And we just sold the Noxious Longbow for 215 mil. We got a couple Onyxes, a lot of supplies. So I, <laughs> I'm in disbelief that we actually got that. But man, what a good, good Rax hour. 642 mil that's huge bro we're like halfway there oh yes dude i think i'm i think i'm gonna just go with raksha also i had an idea for raksha is in my last episode i was talking about using inspiration and juicing out a little bit more accuracy what about using a shadow nihil so since i still have my shadow nihil up from my rack session i'm going to use that and use inspiration and see how well that actually works all right, actually, with that first first kill, um, everything was going pretty well, and that was six minutes flat. So that was a pretty lengthy fight. So I think Ripper Demon's still going to be quite a bit better. My face times were super slow. I don't think I missed it all, but yeah, it was it was super duper slow. I definitely would recommend doing a Ripper Demon. Ah, oh, dude. Okay, um, these kills have been going super super well. With inspiration i don't know really what the difference is but it might just be my experience but my last few kills have been uh like it was a 427 right here my last kill was about a 430 or something like that they've been getting really close to my prs i think it's just a mixture of not wasting ticks and being able to or being more comfortable using the dark bow eos specs and kind of using them at better times than just spamming them but aside from all that, we just passed another 300 Reaper points. So let's go ahead and get ourselves another shiny Hydrix. And that'll put us right over 700 mil. Oh, yeah, dude. 713 mil. Dude, we are <laughs> we are making progress. We're just, according to Sudi, we're about 500 mil, give or take, away from Gricko. Yeah, if we take a look at the current Gricko prices, we are at about... 
1.24 bill is the latest sell from four days ago, six days ago, one week ago. That's pretty much been a lot of the last sales. So we're getting pretty darn close to <laughs> unlocking Grico, man. Just over 500 mil to go. I'm 100% confident that we will not get out by this episode. We are now sitting on 778 mil because we sold off a lot of our supplies from just stuff laying around our bank from boss drops that we've got that weren't uniques and just a couple of odd and end things that I found throughout my bank that have probably been sitting in there for years, but we still have a decent ways to go. Um, I mean, we still have about 450 mil, about 500 mil, give or take. So I am pulling out the big guns. I am going to be going back to hard mode Kara, but I'm going to be doing it with a group. I definitely don't think I can do it solo because it's a pain in the butt to do it with melee in best in slot melee. I'm going to give it a shot in duos with ranged and see how this goes. And this will also be good because I'll be able to get an idea of what it takes to do Kara pack and kind of get an idea of what my rotation would be. Oh, dude. Yeah. I could get used to this amount of money. <laughs> 1.5 mil per kill. Oh, that was good, dude. That was super good. <laughs> what a bait, dude. <laughs> oh my gosh. Oh, geez, dude. <laughs> I mean, it's money. <laughs> and it's a unique, okay. I'll take it. No complaints. Oh, heck yeah, dude. <laughs> dude, nice. I mean, that's not the best at all, but <laughs> uh, that's huge <laughs> for split for this guy. How much till Grico? 350 mil, give or take. I'm probably just going to go to like 1250 because that's a little bit like that's around the current price. But whenever I start to get close, I'm going to be going with whatever like the average of like the last few offers is not to like an exact amount but once i pretty much get in the ballpark that's what i'm going to consider that i bought right Rico. done a lot of bossing off stream um off camera and all that stuff and we've sold quite a few of our just supplies drops that we've gotten over time and i also had a large stack of ripper demons that i bought a while ago I don't know if it, I can't remember if it was early in the season or not, but I mean, I just cut that stack in half and that helped to inflate my pouch a little bit. Now, I know people won't normally have stuff available to them like that, but I mentioned earlier in the series that I do want to kind of cut into things that I do have because, you know, it's stuff that I've earned and I also don't want to get caught up at this step of the grind. Like, I just don't want this to drag on for forever because I already have Gricko unlocked and I do have the funds to get it right now. It's just, I do want to see if I can get some drops. So if it comes down to it, I'll probably just sell my last few Hydrix or something to just kind of afford the Gricko drop. And then we will just unlock Gricko because I do really, really, really want to test it out at some bosses very soon. Nice. That's a new range PR. 220.4. Heck yeah, dude. Oh, heck yeah, dude. 120 range, dude. Heck yeah. That's so sick. Yo, <laughs> 409. Wow. That is major. That is a major improvement from a 424. Things were just going smooth, dude. That was that was great. It's probably been a grand total of maybe anywhere to 30 seconds to two minutes since I mentioned this, but it has been realistically closer to maybe 12 hours or so, give or take, with how much time I've spent trying to get this last 200 or so mil <laughs> from... Uh, just grinding different bosses and everything with whatever my schedule allowed. I did a lot of necks the other night. I honestly did about five to six hours of necks straight, not a single drop. Some of those were duos. A lot of that was solos. I've done about three or four hours at Care Pack. I've also done about three or four hours at Raksha. So it's just been super, super, super dry for drops lately, which I can't really complain. I've gotten a lot in the past, but as I mentioned before, I don't want this to really be a holdup of the series because I really want to try out Gricko really really soon so what i'm gonna do is i'm going to sell these four hydrix to afford the last little bit of the grico money and then i'm going to price check what the current sale of grico is and i'm going to add a little bit to it for the sake of a giveaway all right so judging by sudibot it is going down 
quite a bit. The latest sale was 13 hours ago at 1.191 mil. So that's, I was planning on doing 1.3 bill originally and then 1.25 bill, but with this being the current price, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna honor the 1.25 bill um, for the sake of giveaways. And there's also gonna be a little bit of extra giveaway stuff. So I went ahead and deposited 1.25 bill into the bank for a giveaway. But there's a few extra things for this giveaway and that is going to be, they're kind of spread out throughout my bank, but it's basically a ranged set that was provided by Seraphim. It is going to be a full set of Serenic, a Zarite bow, and then basically 500 bolts, like a whole entire Becker Middle bolt set of like Hydrix bolts, Onyx bolts, Dragonstone bolts. Some of them are kind of mixed in with my own personal bolts. And what that's gonna be for is it's actually gonna be for an extra sort of giveaway on Twitch. So I don't wanna get too into the giveaways right now because I still want to do some more content. I wanna actually try out Gricko on some bosses, get used to how it functions and see how much better my kill times can be. So I'm probably gonna do a few bosses and then I'll get into the giveaway information, but let's get into the bosses with Gricko. I'm gonna do this Vindy and then I'm also going to go, we just had demon spawn. I wanna make sure I get that to Noit. Oh my gosh, dude. Vindy's like tab target thing is so wonky. Holy crap, a 32.4. What? I don't even know what just happened. <laughs> Dude, that's sick. Oh, heck yes, dude. Yes, bro. Heck yeah, bro. <laughs> oh, yeah, dude. Oh, that feels good, dude. There's the dry streak. All gone, brother. <laughs> Just, oh, wait, I gotta pick it up. <laughs> dude, I almost didn't pick it up. <laughs> can we get the back to back? Oh, we can, dude. <laughs> Yo. <laughs> Oh, that's so good. <laughs> oh, that's so good, bro. <laughs> oh, man, that's three more pings for Calvin. Can we get full Torva this hour? <laughs> oh, bro, that's so good. Oh, my gosh, dude, no way. <laughs> Yo, holy crap, dude. What in the frick is going on? <laughs> Dude, oh my gosh, three more pings for Calvin, bro. Dude, I'm amped. Oh, I saw it. We got Onyx bolts, that's good. That's good enough. Counts as a drop, tag him three times. <laughs> the mod told me to. <laughs> Dude, I just got a new duo PR, heck yeah, bro. Nice. I mean, granted, a majority of that is Rad's doing, but heck yeah, dude. Holy crap. This is... This is a major kill time improvement so far. You know, if I... Assuming I don't die. Dude, what? I've never phased when the timer was still white. <laughs> That's insane. That's actually major, bro. Heck yeah, dude. A sub four, dude. That is nice. First sub four with range. Heck yeah. Slightly better. Slightly better. And that's all I have for you today, guys. I hope you enjoyed this episode of Reckless Ranger. But before we end this episode, we have a giveaway to go over. So let's get into the nitty gritty details. There are going to be a total of 13 100 mil giveaways. I have 1.25 bill in the bank and I've been editing and thinking that's a little bit of a weird number. So I'm going to just round it up to 1.3 bill. And seven of those 100 mil giveaways are gonna be on YouTube with six being over on Twitch on Monday stream at 7.30 p.m. EST. As for the missing 100 mil on Twitch, that extra giveaway is going to be the range set that I mentioned earlier in this video. So it kind of evens out. 
Note that you can win once per platform. So if you watch me on Twitch and you watch me on YouTube, you have a chance to win up to 200 mil. To enter the Twitch giveaway, make sure to catch my Monday stream at 7.30 p.m. Eastern time, which is 30 minutes before reset. I will be doing all of the Twitch giveaways during that stream all throughout the stream. As for the YouTube giveaway, make sure to drop a comment down below with your in-game username. And if you wanna take it a step further, let me know what boss you want to see me do from now on now that I have Grico unlocked. This won't add any extra chance to winning for the giveaway. I'm just personally curious what you want to see. With all that being said, guys, if you enjoyed this video, make sure to leave a like, drop a comment down below, and make sure to follow me over on Twitch so you can be a part of the progress. We have a really good time over there. A lot of laughs. At least I'm laughing a lot, sometimes at myself, and it is a lot of fun all around to just hang out with viewers on Twitch and even sometimes run some bosses with you guys. Aside from that, make sure to subscribe to the channel if you want to see more content like this. Once again, guys, I'm Rayo, and I'll see you next time. Take care.